Hey guys, um, today I'm doing a whole hamster thing. I'm just showing you all my supplies for my hamsters. Not all of them, but most of them. So, I have my treat jar, my food jar, a treat that I don't have anywhere to put it, um, my Tiesto toppings, hay, and bedding. So let's start with the treats. So this is a, um, a very well-sealed container that my mother gave me. And it, this is my, it's just my treat jar. So these are my Cheesy Chews by uh, Wild Harvest. They are totally, I got them today, but um, I put it one in my hamster's cage because it comes with a pack of two. And he's already eaten like 50% maybe more of it, so highly recommend it. It's only like $2.99. Um, these are Vitacraft uh, alfalfa hay spear, uh, spears. Um, they're really healthy, but the thing is he doesn't totally like eat them fully. He just kind of nibbles on them. But I still, yeah, I still recommend them. But they're kind of pricey. They're like five dollars, I think. Um, on Amazon. These are my Yahoo's. They're peanut butter Yahoo's by Wild Harvest as well. Um, yeah, I recommend these. They do really love them. They're the hard ones. So good. I love them. So, yeah, definitely, you know, look into the bottom of this thing. This is my food. Another bigger container. I use Hazel Hamster Mix, which I highly recommend. It's the best hand food I'm pretty sure. Um, I use peas and uh, carrot toppings. These are what's in the bag. Um, it's a little bag and I just mix it in there with them. And I also have these mineral salt chews that are really healthy for me, which I hate, but um, it's still, I always have to, I always like having a, a mineral chew hanging around somewhere trying to be, you know, healthy and eating it. Um, it comes with a lot of good stuff in here. I just, I would really recommend getting some hairy cancer, uh, cancer mix. Next, I have this dental chewing thing. Um, I do have a nut knot nibbler, but he doesn't really like it, so I just leave that in his cage. But he does actually like these. This is some type of hay. I'm pretty sure it's alfalfa. And then this is apple cider wood, the bark. And um, he has one in his cage right now. Uh, he 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 likes it, I guess. Um, it's safe to chew, all natural, and prevents boredom. It's clean, sweep and chew. And yeah, I'd recommend it if your hamster's a chewer. This I do not recommend. Petco's version of the Timothy Hay. It sucks. He does not eat it. It's horrible. He just pushes it out of his cage. Don't get it. Unless you have someone that really likes it. Um, <clears throat> this is KT Fiesta Papaya Flavored Healthy Toppings. I also got these today, but he just eats them right out of my palm. He, I, I'm pretty sure he likes them, and I'm pretty sure they're pretty healthy. Um, so yeah, I'd recommend getting them. I'm, I've seen them in so many videos, I'm pretty sure they're just kind of a must-buy. So yeah, I, I, I did get it. I did get it. And then I'm just here fresh colors bedding. Which I really like. It's pretty good odor control. I clean it every Sunday, the stage. And he's a 20 gallon tank, so it's pretty it's pretty big. Um it's I, I like the blue one. It's pretty nice, actually. It's really soft. It's good for bedding. Um, what I would really recommend doing is what I'm going to start doing is I'm going to half the stage and I'm going to um, get Casey's, uh, Casey's Cozy Clean because it's really, really soft. And I'm going to mix the bedding, or just half it. And so um, he has to hide away from his thingy. He has his uh, 42 piece. Play set for me and his big wood. And so I'll put one of them in each and see which one he likes more. And actually, you know, not help it, but can't really like this one more. So these are most of my supplies. Um, leave me a comment knowing if you guys want me to do or if you want anything. And I will definitely do it. Um, thanks for watching. Bye.